The New York Fire Department will recruit robot dogs from Boston Dynamics, a robotics company to help firefighters in search and rescue missions, according to fire officials. Each machine dog cost about $75,000. With the plans in the months ahead, the department is the first fire agency in the U.S. to put money into these robots known as SPOT. Captain Michael Leo from the fire department's robotics unit said that the robot dogs are safe and will help to save lives. The TV industry and the movie industry are hurting us in some ways because they often show pictures of robots that are weaponized, and then people think that's how all robots are, he added. According to officials, the robot dogs will be operated by a human and they will be able to collect images and data during dangerous search and rescue missions and measure the danger of toxic gases. Although Albert Fox Kahn, a lawyer based at NYU School of Law, agreed that it would be great if the dog actually worked to keep firefighters safe. He has expressed concerns about the way the robots would collect and use data in the future. He told the New York Times, the history has always been that even if it is first brought in for a compelling case, you get this creep where it's used for more and more scenarios until it's reaching areas where it just doesn't feel justifiable. The police department cut short its contract with Boston Dynamics last April due to concerns about the privacy of the robot dogs and fears that they were unsettling. The NYPD tested the robots during an arrest in a public housing building in Manhattan before using them in a hostage situation in the Bronx. Congresswoman Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez described the dog as a robotic surveillance ground drone. In addition, the American Civil Liberties Union expressed fear that it could one day make law enforcement decisions were it to be unchecked. This had sparked outrage. New York's counterterrorism chief John Miller told the New York Times that the dog had become a target to criticize the police. Boston Dynamic claims on its website that the machine is not designed to conduct mass surveillance or replace police officers.